Hello everyone, welcome to my second uh, car MD11 cargo review. I'll leave a link in the description to the other one, which is the Aeroflot cargo. Today we will be reviewing the Alitalia cargo. MD11F. Uh, now this is the last plane I'll be reviewing in my lot. In my lot, I know I can hear you all groaning it already. I did buy the Allegiant Airbus A320, Allegiant Airbus A319, Allegiant Airbus Boeing 757, and also the Allegiant MD80. Right there. So yeah, and this is the last plane. It's Alitalia Cargo. I made it. I know this may seem a bit random, but meh, whatevs. So yeah, let's get started. Um, on the box, the box, the box is a bit dusty. Could use some work, but I didn't expect that because it is free shipping. So, right here we have the Alitalia Cargo plane. Alitalia, Alitalia Cargo McDonnell Douglas MD11 logo. 1400 scale in the green, which is kind of ironic because Alitalia is famous for its green colors. Now on the inside, we do have information because I'm so used to reviewing the Allegiant planes, which don't have information on the inside. So yeah, you can take a minute to pause and read that. Visit our website for new releases, GeminiJust.com, but I don't buy it from there. I buy it from Airline Museum. That's where the plane goes, and on the back we have the plane climbing. And release date 20... 2009. 2009. There's loads left in stock if you still want to buy them. Mainly because Alitalia Cargo went went kaput a long time ago. But I still want it because it's the only Alitalia Cargo I can even Alitalia planet I can even get. All Alitalia 767s, A330s, all were sold out. So yeah, let's get started. Up on the front we do have our windshield wipers. And I bet that's, and I think that's about it for the nose, to be honest. We have our windshield, we have our cockpit windows. But we do not have any passenger windows, which I'm not used to seeing, but there is a big word cargo there, so you know that it's a cargo jet. We have a Sky Team livery, with a Sky Team logo. Um, we have our car, we have our door, we have the Alitalia logo, with a big cargo smash right next to it. Um, as you can see, we have the green line going from here all the way up to the tail, where it meets with the red. And it looks kind of cool with its pumped out like in 3D, thanks to the third en thanks to the third engine, thanks to the second engine, which is in the tail. Basically, if you don't know how, how MG11 or DC10 pilots number them, it goes one, two, three. So this is always the second engine. However, I will claim it the third engine since it is in the back. And we also have our exhaust pipe. Not exhaust pipe. We also have our exhaust tube where the carbon dioxide comes out. And no APU power power unit. No, no APU, which is kind of surprising. However, I do not judge. I will not judge because this is a 2009 model, and Gemini just has increased their has increased their production activity, and also detailedness in the past. I don't know, five years, six years actually, because it is 2015. What do you think, pilot? Oh, for God's sake! So the registration is E I U P E. Repeat E I U P E. So on the top view, we can see that we do have the Alitalia logo on both sides. However, this side has the registration, which is again E I U P E. U P E. -E. Sorry, voice crack. <clears throat> Been talking all day today. Um, we have our three wheels, not rolling. However, so I can hear, I can hear all the groans already. We have Gemini Just logo, chrome display stand hole, um, compartment. Doors. I was just checking. Compartment doors for the landing gear, for the front landing gear, and we also have a bit of the APU down there, but not the full thing. So yeah, guys, that is our review after about Alitalia Cargo. It was a branch off of Alita of Al off of off of Alitalia. However, it did go out of did go bankrupt. So yeah, just like our fellow here, the Aeroflot Cargo. So both airlines went out of business because of their because of not much of their. Productivity. However, did not notice the default. This is supposed to have a black nose up there, just like most Alitalia planes back then. It's supposed to have a black nose, yet this one doesn't. So that's a little defect. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that, or it is actually a little typo, quote unquote. So yeah, guys, future videos. Still the X Plane Nine, Gemini Just reviews monthly. I'm saying now because I get fifty dollars of allowance every. 
uh, every month, so I will be buying $50 worth of planes every month. So yeah. Thank you all for liking and subscribing on this video. Um, liking and sharing on this video. Um, also, subscribe for daily x 9 videos and Gemini Just videos. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Ciao. See? See? Punny? Hmm? You get it? Ciao. Bye-bye.